A foundation has been set up to honour the memory of the three Mazin children, 100 days after the plane they were on was shot down. As their parents grieved their loss in the MH17 disaster, they're now helping other children. Their beautiful smiling faces became a symbol of the innocent lives lost in the MH17 tragedy. Now these images will be forever intertwined with a new legacy. A fund called the Mo Evie and Otis Maslin Foundation has been established to help children with learning difficulties. The cause close to the heart of parents Maz and Rin because eight-year-old Otis had dyslexia. Otis' diagnosis from the Dyslexia Spelled Foundation of WA was waiting for us in the mail when we arrived home after our world ended, Mazenrin said. Otis is incredibly funny and is creative beyond belief. He was and is the happiest soul you've ever met. But the classroom was not a place for him and his diagnosis clearly stated that it would only get harder for him as classroom difficulty increased. Maz and Rin hopeful the foundation will assist teachers in finding new ways to help children with dyslexia and in particular focus on early intervention. Early intervention is the key to helping those kids function well. Um, there are plenty of examples of, uh, of people with dyslexia who have gone on to be uh, truly excellent uh, people and high achievers. Donations can be made to the Mo, Evie and Otis Maslin Foundation. Tegan Sapwell, Nine News.